Hi guys, welcome to the Ready Hop with me Dee. Today we're going to do some simple yoga poses to work on strengthening the whole back. So if you do have any back injuries or anything, um, just be really careful with this one. I want you to first listen to your body and then listen to me. If something doesn't feel right, then simply just don't do it. Um, so we're going to be working on the floor today. So grab yourself a comfortable spot and we can get started. So we're just going to begin in a cross-legged seated position as we bring the awareness to the breath. As we begin to inhale and exhale through the nose. As you inhale, feel your stomach rise. And as you exhale, feel it fall. And just focus on this breath for a few rounds you arrive on your mat for your practice. Make sure that your spine is straight and long. Shoulders can be up, back and down, relaxed away from the ears. On our next inhale, we're going to engage the core. So you're tightening the muscles in the stomach area. And we're going to try and keep these tightened for all of today's practice. So inhaling, you're inhaling deeply into the chest and upper cavity. Stomach doesn't expand as much as you contract the muscles. So just focus on this breath for a few rounds till you get comfortable with it. So we're going to begin today's practice on all fours. So if you come to bring the palms down under the shoulders, the knees are hip distance apart under the hips. We're just going to commence with some cat cow. So as we inhale, we'll drop the navel towards the mat and look up towards the sky. Just to loosen up the spine, exhaling, curling the spine, bringing the chin to the chest, pushing into the palms of the hands to stretch the back of the shoulders. Inhaling back up. And exhaling down. Inhaling up. And exhaling. One more round. inhale we'll come back to center we're going to walk the knees back and we're going to come down to lie down on our stomach so, so slowly lower down onto our mat we're going to keep the arms beside the chest and as we exhale we're just going to gently raise the upper body off the mat drawing the shoulders back you don't have to push into the arms just using the back muscles just hover here for a couple of breaths And exhale to lower down, bring your forehead down to your mat and just take a rest here for a couple of breaths. Next time we're going to lift the head, bring the elbows under the shoulders, palms flat to the mat in front. Just gently bring your gaze forward, keeping the feet flat on the mat, coming into a deeper cobra pose here. Palms are flat on the mat, elbows are under the shoulders, shoulders, blades are squeezing together, shoulders are down away from the ears. Take a couple of breaths here. Now feel free to stay here if you want to deepen the stretch. You can push into your palms, begin to lift the elbows, you can engage the glutes a little. Check the lower back. If you feel any pain or discomfort, then just come back down to wherever you're comfortable. We'll take a couple of breaths here or wherever you are. And 
exhaling, slowly lowering back down to your mat. Bring your hands into a pillow, rest your forehead on the back of your hands and take a couple of breaths there. Lift your forehead, release your hands. We're gonna swing them around and come to interlace your fingers behind your back. Bring the palms of the hands together if you can. And as we exhale, we're gonna lift up, pushing the arms back, using the back muscles to lift the upper body off the mat. And exhale, slowly lower back down. Take a breath here. Keeping the arms interlaced behind the back. This time we're gonna come up and raise the legs as well as the upper body. Coming up, lifting the legs off the mat, engaging the back, core is active. Take a couple of breaths here. Remembering to breathe and exhale, slowly lower back down. You can release the hands, bring them into a pillow and just take a rest here for a couple of breaths. Next inhale, lift the forehead, bend the knees. We're gonna bring the arms around again and reach back for the ankles. So you can reach for the toes or come down to the ankles. Now, if this is enough of a stretch for you, feel free to stay here and just focus on the breath, inhaling and exhaling through the nose. Or if you'd like to take it a little deeper on your next inhale, we're gonna lift the upper body and the legs just gently up off of the mat. Exhale to release. The legs come out in front. Again, we'll bring the hands into a pillow, rest the head. Take a couple of breaths. Next inhale, lift the forehead, bring the palms down beside the chest, pushing into the palms. We're gonna come back up onto the knees and come into a wide-legged child's pose. So you can bring the knees out to the edges of the mat or as wide as you'd like them to go. Come to sit back onto the heels, walk the palms out in front, bring your forehead down to your mat just to stretch out the lower back after those gentle back bends. We'll hold it here for a few breaths. Next inhale, we'll lift our forehead, walk our palms back. As we come to sit on our heels, we can lean back. And we're going to bring the legs out in front. We'll just come into a gentle forward fold, again stretching out that lower back after the back bends. Inhaling, lengthening the spine, core is tight, shoulders up, back and down. Exhaling, we're hinging from the hips. And gently just coming to fold forward. So if you feel it on the hamstrings here and gently on the lower back as well. You can reach for the shins, the ankles. we come to interlace the fingers around the big toes, inhaling to lengthen the spine and exhaling, folding a little deeper to the pose. Feel free to have a bend in the knees here if you like. Inhaling, slowly rising back up to centre. You can come to bend the knees. And we're going to gently 
come to lie down on our backs. So you can slowly lower down with control, keeping the core tight. We're going to keep the knees bent, hip distance apart. So you should be able to touch your heels with your fingertips. So we're going to come up into a bridge pose. So we're going to push into the soles of the feet. You can use the palms of the hands here, flat on the mat also. And as you exhale, we're just going to lift the hips. We'll hold it here for a few breaths. Exhale to lower down. And relax. Take a breath here. Next exhale, we're going to push into the soles of the feet again, pushing those hips up towards the ceiling. So you can stay like this, or you can interlace the fingers behind the back. Come to shuffle up a little onto the shoulders. Take a couple of breaths here. Exhaling, slowly lowering back down, releasing the hands from behind the back. We're going to come to hug the knees into the chest. So you can just put your palms on your knees or you can come to hug opposite elbows around the knees. And just gently massage your lower back into your mat, gently rocking from side to side. You can begin to move in a circular motion. First one way and changing direction around the other. Do whatever feels good for you here. As you exhale, release your legs out in front, bring the heels to the edges of the mat, arms away from the body, palms facing up, and just come to close your eyes. Bring your breath back to your natural rhythm. And just bring awareness to your body. See if you feel any difference from the beginning to the end of your practice. And with each exhale, just allow your body to sink deeper and deeper into your mat. As you feel totally relaxed. Allow yourself to lie here in Shavasana for as long as you need. Whenever you're ready, you can start to wiggle your fingers and your toes, your ankles and your wrists. And gently rock your head from side to side. Next inhale, reach your arms back overhead, bring the feet together and stretch the whole body. As you exhale, bring the knees into the chest. You can cross the ankles. We're going to come to rock up to seated. So as you inhale, bring the knees in close to the chest. Exhale, come back up to seated. So we come back to a cross-legged seated position. Hands to your knees. We'll just take a deep breath here, inhaling and exhaling through the nose. Next inhale, we'll reach our arms up overhead, bring them 
into prayer. Exhaling back down to heart center. Namaste.